Hello, my name is Dr. Fizz, aka Sexy Shark. I'm Dragon Ring Olive, just like last playthrough, Dragon Fart. I'm Destrophy, and I'm a horny pika. <laughs> well, uh, today we're gonna be playing Fibbage. Fuck. A game where you lie. We're really good at it. I'm horny. I hope not. Aren't you always? Uh, yeah, I have a Welcome sexual. Whatever the word is. Problem? Yeah, it's depression. Sexual depression. Three players. Okay, everyone. Secretly think of which of the other two you like better. Uh, Let's do this. Both of you are way out of my food chain. <laughs> the other two that you like. But I have the call of a champion, so. That means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made up answer. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Choose out. I do the bone. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Ha! <laughs> Right, cool. Okay, here's your first question. Barbara E. Maddock wrote the book A Guide to Bone um, Blank of the 19th this can go and anyway. 20th Centuries. And to your lies now. Got mine. I got it in. You shut up. <laughs> All right, where's the truth? <laughs> 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 I feel like I know which one is dragon. What? <laughs> I almost picked it just because. Why wouldn't you pick that? It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you guys. Oh, man? Yes. Are you kidding? <laughs> I thought I had tears brush. I guess that makes sense. I mean, I, I didn't... was laughing too much. I just chose something. I guess it's in Wales, so. Nobody else's lives got picked. Oh, I forgot to like that. I feel like she would have made a. <laughs> I think that's a guide we all need. <laughs> Yeah, I choose. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. Okay, here's the question. The University of Victoria offers a physical education class called the Science of Blank. Type in your lies now. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> um, I. God, yeah. There's two hard ones. There's two hard yeah, ones. Yeah, there is. I'm going with the obvious, of course. I don't do the obvious. I'm doing the obvious. Gotta be the science of Batman. All right, let's see what everybody <laughs> picked. Thank God. Yes! God, you guys make me so horny. Huh. I did it! I told you. Obvious. I figured you guys would have picked STIs. That, no, that's, that makes too much sense. Hard love. Shit. <laughs> that's shit. I didn't have time to make the word Alright, it's my turn. Flight, chocolate chip, wax, married, Afghanistan. You better hurry, because they all don't choose. Alright, hey, chose. In 2002, Bruce Willis sent 12,000 boxes of blank to U.S. soldiers <laughs> in Afghanistan. Enter your lies now. I know exactly what he sent. I read this in People Once. <laughs> Thank you for getting all those. Okay, here you go. Find the <laughs> <laughs> Well, um. <laughs> There's not even a choice in this. It's a whole man that's about to It's gotta, gotta be straight <laughs> dildos. I mean, why, who, why else would you send 
I mean, you can use them as a shank or, you know. A flippy flop. <laughs> it's definitely flippy flops. 12,000 boxes of hats. <laughs> to my oh, I'm oh, I'm tied. Me and you are tied. Yes, I'm funny. <laughs> this is round two. Oh, it's only on. Point values are doubled. Oh. You're going slow. Right. Oh, it's going fast. What is it, Johnny? No. Oh, I. Flow Rider. That's Florida. No. It's not hard. You know what? We'll just stick with this yeah, one. Yeah, see, it's no, not hard. John Larroquette. John Larroquette was paid not with money, but with blank. Oh. Uh. Well, I don't know. I mean, what else would you want to be paid in, right? You can see commercials about it everywhere. Hot sex. <laughs> You get it? Okay, yeah. here are your choices. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Alright, well. I know it's not one of them. They're open out for a I feel like I, my mind was definitely wrong. Yes! Nobody ever pays me in gum. Well, he did get paid. And I am awesome at this. Wait, is that the point of the game, is to get things right? And nobody picked or you just do yeah. the most funniest thing? Well, you try to psych out the other players, but oh. also get the right thing. Well, clearly I did. Yeah, you did. Yeah, cool. Yes! <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Kill and stab. Oh, okay. Okay, here's the question. In 2012, the teenager from Westlaco, Texas, claimed the reason he stabbed his friend was because a blank... Definitely Supernatural, I know. Yeah. Enter your lies now. Supernatural tells me everything. Teenager. That's peer pressure. Don't ever get into that. Okay, what did everyone pick? Damn it. <laughs> yes. I'm always the odd man out. I know it was right like... because it was actually spelled right, I think. Do I have and spell check? Nobody else's oh. Yeah, we have our spell checks on. Oh do you? Yeah, we do. I clearly don't. Wow, I am kicking ass. Hey, I caught up to Jordan. I caught up to you. Someone <laughs> like mine. Oh. Okay, show my old category. face. Alfred? There's two Alfred. villages. You have to do Alfred. He doesn't have to do anything. I'm gonna do Alfred. No, 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 that's okay. I guess I'm not gonna do Alfred. It took too long. Oh. Belmont University in Nashville has offered a class called Oh Look, a Blank. Type in your lies now. I haven't been taking any of these serious. Oh, uh, no, never. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> A bear fucker. <laughs> it's, I don't think it's that. He's probably that. Oh look, a dick. He's oh, look, a dick. Hey, right, wait, what the hell's that? <laughs> Got this shit, man. We're gonna be a sexy piker that's horny. It's about embracing distraction as a way of that's part shark. <laughs> the beginning of the resurgence of it's American education. Sexy horny shark pica. Sharka. Sh a shark. PR. Park. Picar. Picar. When you weren't here, there was actually you could lose points for selecting the game's life. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah. That's... It's time for the 
I was wondering what was different. And now it's at the point where, like, good luck finding the wrong one because there's three just answers are so out of the ordinary. I don't know, Beans was pretty close to everyone else. Peter McGee. The, what? Name of the man on the Quaker Oats. I should know this one. I mean, our history teacher was like... Oh, um... I know it. I think I got it right. Go right. Because I want to see if I'm smart. Dirk Diggler. Oats man. William Penn. <laughs> Well, now I don't know what to pick. Oats man. <laughs> Oats man. <laughs> I just got Oats man. Larry. All right, who picked the watch? Oh. I didn't think I was lying. Oats <laughs> man. So it's Larry. Oh. That's messed up. I thought they were going to put out a last you name. I thought it was William Penn because he's a Quaker and... Well, I thought it was... Virginia. Wasn't he just the guy who... No, Will... I don't know. William Holy Penn's hell. the guy named after Pennsylvania. I am the winner. I am undisputed. Who got the most likes? Oh. And me. I am all-around champion. Of that round. Of, of, of that round. I straight up slaughtered. You. You do another round. Yeah. yeah. Do another round? Well, I, what, take it easy. We gotta... We don't need to do an introduction. We'll just go into the next round. All right, fine. Go into the next round. Same players? Yeah. Oh, I don't have to touch anything. No. Hi, I'm Cookie Masterson, and this ain't my first rodeo. I go to that next week. Whee! I see we have two smart players this game, and one total moron. I think you know who I'm talking about. Let's do this. <laughs> This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get 1,000 points. 16,000 to 5,000? Right, pick a category. Dewey. Oh. I Dewey. haven't okay, got one of those yet. First question. A man in western Pennsylvania got a DUI for having an open can of beer while riding a blank. Type oh. in your lies hmm. now. And an open can of beer while riding a. That didn't happen. Yeah, it did. Yeah, it did. No, it didn't. I heard it. No, I felt it. Hurry up. Use a suggestion if you can't think of it. You didn't feel nothing. <laughs> okay, here you go. Find the truth. Riding a carriage. Hmm. Let's see what everybody selected. All right. <laughs> huh. That's that's a good start. Nice. Wow, we're smart. All got it. Oh, the other three just didn't make sense. <laughs> a unicycle on fire. That one I knew was out there. Really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, Yay. someone like four. Yeah, you're welcome. Time to pick a category. Tara. Uh, I bought on okay, here's eBay. The question. First item listed on <laughs> eBay was what? a um, oh. link. Enter your lies now. Come on, Fibbage. Boring. Let me, uh... I got my lie entered. Oh, this can go so many different ways. Yeah. Okay, Dang it. Here are your choices. <laughs> oh shit. I don't even care if it's yeah. wrong. This is awesome. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! For that. Yay! Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> They both made perfect good sense. But I feel like that's just the truth. I'm getting yeah. That's the truth, clearly. It says it. it was good job, George. By a cat who was just well, I have the other one. <laughs> oh. Glass cat. Good detective work. 
Oh god, I got a full head. <laughs> Shows? Why? Condom for every condom. Oh! Yeah. Select the category. Oh, I thought um, you meant why I chose. You never pull out, you only pull in. Okay, here's the question. In 2006, the Wax Museum Madame Tussauds in New York City introduced its first wax blank. Type in your lies now. So quiet and intense. Of course, I'm all about the intensity. So focused right now. So focused. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> huh. Well... <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> this is gonna be the right answer. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> oh. <laughs> First wax baby. That's huh? weird. Yeah, that's creepy. I don't oh, even man. like normal babies. Much less a fake one that looks real. I don't want to poop into my It was a big one. It's the one from South Park. I don't know, I'm getting there. I'm catching right back up. Round two. More points. Now it's round, round two. Rounds why? All point values are doubled. Let's do it. All right. Well, I'm pick a category. Facial. Oh. <laughs> yes. Of course. Why not? Okay. Here's the question. For one hundred eighty dollars, the oh, Shizuka New York skincare salon offers an unusual but traditional Japanese facial that is part <laughs> rice bran and part blank. Jeez, now. we're all probably going to put the exact same two, aren't we? <laughs> I, I highly doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's <laughs> just... Tummy <laughs> bears is good. That's my thing. Let's see what everybody oh, we all got the truth. <laughs> this gotta be the yeah, truth. Yeah, I had to have been. But I mean, Godzilla semen. That... If I could pick my own, I would have picked it. Everyone's a winner. Although, I know a guy who only charges 20 bucks. Hey, I mean, that's where Godzilla's from, right? right? Japan? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, see? That makes sense then. I'm special. We all have to. Yay! Oh, wait, wait, what? <laughs> There's only three of us. You can like multiple ones. Oh, can oh, you? I didn't know that. Yeah, you just get quick. Oh, I guess you can. I just didn't. Kevin Spacey. I know him. Modern Warfare. Okay, here's the question. Kevin Spacey's older brother is a blank impersonator. Save from Modern Warfare. Your lies now. It's advanced warfare. You do that. Whatever. Or that. <laughs> don't ever, <laughs> don't even talk awful. about that. Not a good campaign. He's the dude from Horrible Bosses, House of Cards. He played Lex Luthor in that shitty Superman movie. Hurry up. Use a I'm use a suggestion. I got this. Rod Stewart. Okay, <laughs> Balls impersonator. Joker impersonator. That's... That's so great. Noise impersonator. All right, who picked the watch? Ha. It made sense. <laughs> yeah, well, that was the point. I only know that I'm probably a Rod Stewart impersonator because I doubt any of you would have ever even thought of his name. So, uh, I figured it just seemed. That family. I didn't like it. And nobody <laughs> fell for some of these ingenious lies. Balls impersonator. I'm pointing so Mike up in front. I panicked. Like always. Joker was good. Text message. 
55,000. 55,000. Yeah, yeah, that's... All right, Alex, you're back. Okay, here's the question. Owning 55,000 of them, Ted Turner has the world's largest um, private collection of... TVs. Enter your lies now. I don't know. Do you know what Ted Turner is? Nope, I don't care. Owns, like, TNT? Mm. News channel? No. He has a house where we're from. Places. Yeah. All right, where's the truth? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, if he has a lot of I feel like, oh God. <laughs> Let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> Makes sense, so it's gotta be the bison, which I didn't know there's 55,000 of them still. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. Well, yeah, of course. I mean, why not? Oh. Why are they saying they're extinct if there's that much? That's a lot. Used to be that's a that's lot. where they all did. <laughs> Ted Turner will give them up. You better share, Ted Turner. He's not gonna share. He's no gonna one got like. Yay! Aww. Use condoms. No, just Good normal ones. ones. Used ones. This, this, is, I don't, this, this is the only place I could pull in front. I have to find the truth. This this is the truth. Yeah, you'll go to the camera. fair and just pick up all the condoms game. you find scattered everywhere. That's gross. Here's your final Fibbage question. The name of the Kermit the Frog inspired collection oh, made by January Productions in 1995. Type in your lies now. Oh, I got it. I got this. I think I got this. Okay. Miss Piggy Speed. What? Froggy Fragrance. Froggy Fragrance. God damn it. That sucks. Aww. There was no good puns to come up with. That means I lost. Froggy Fragrance was pretty good. Looking to have sex with a pig. Pee. <laughs> Gross. And we're done. And there's a time between me and Tanner. We got this. <laughs> I'm tired of it both of you. Bullshit. We are a horny dragon. A horny dragon. <laughs> I don't know if this time I'll be with the funnier one. It's, it's not fair. Hey, you suck at this. I don't think you get it. You know you're supposed to get the most points, right? Shut up. <laughs> well, this was Fibbage with Dr. Fizz, a.k.a. Sexy Shark. Destrophy, also known as a horny pika. And Dragon Regalda's Dragon Park.